Hi, I'm Dr. Caroline Leaf. In this video blog, I want to share about the Dirty Dozen with you. The Dirty Dozen are 12 areas of toxic thinking. So what you do is you take this five step switch on your brain process, which is the technique for rewiring the brain. And then to help you to organize your program, you select one of the dirty dozen, which are 12 areas of toxic thinking that then help you to be very focused and disciplined in your approach to renewing your mind. Remember, renewing your mind is a lifelong process. It's not something you do once and then stop and never do the and never do it again. The same thing with the 12, the dirty dozen. It's not in any particular order. You can do any order. You can work exactly where you need to work is where you need to work. But by categorizing into the dirty dozen, it just helps you to be more focused as you go through the renewing of the mind process. So if you think of a tree, a tree has roots. Now I want you to imagine that this particular tree that I'm describing has 12 roots and those 12 roots are embedded in the soil. And obviously those 12 roots will then produce a tree trunk and those, that tree trunk will then produce branches. And on the branches we'll have leaves and fruit. So when you talk about these, when I talk about the dirty dozen, those 12 roots represent the dirty dozen. So the thoughts are the roots and they will produce the fruit. So when you have got toxic roots watered in the soil of fear, then it's going to produce toxic branches and toxic fruit. And we see that ma manifesting in, in our life. If it's healthy, if it's healthy roots, so you can have 12 healthy roots when we're trying to get the unhealthy roots to be healthy roots or the toxic roots to be healthy roots. When we do that, then we will have healthy fruit in our life. So I'm going to go through in a series of video blogs each of these 12 roots and how they can become toxic and how it impacts on, has very various manifestations that are the, the, the branches and the, le the leaves and the fruit. And those various manifestations are things like physical illnesses, mental illnesses, um, all kinds of things that can go wrong that manifest because what we, what we think about is going to impact our body, the health of our mind and of our body.